lovely, lovely day. Absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance. Great consequence in this part of the world. They've been talking about this one for a while and they have uh, rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the hour or two leading up to it. It has been bumper to bumper. The traffic has been extraordinary, but the level of expectation is also very, very high. And uh, these supporters who uh, were queuing round the block for their tickets as soon as we knew the date of the fixture, well, now they can't wait for it to begin. And begin it will any second now. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. It appears to be a 4-4-2 formation, Jim. Well, the obvious standout in today's football in this system is that it provides you with extra presence in attack. With many shaky defences about, getting the right partnership in that department can pay rich dividends as long as there's a good early supply. So playing two strikers can, um, can be a real help to this team. I mean, 4-4-2 these days, Peter, gets a lot of criticism, but it's, it's unfair. Any system can work if you've got the right players. There's the whistle. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Well, I would say one of the most energetic midfielders you'll find in Jordan Henderson. He's added to all that running power with slicker passing and some very impressive finishing, and, and he's a proper leader now too. He would be the obvious choice, wouldn't he? He certainly has all the right qualities. Brady. Bardsley. Bardsley plays it forward. Robertson. It's a very good battle there. Terrific to watch. Looks to bypass the midfield. Fabinho. Fabinho clips one through. And the shot! Looking for a decent ball in. Mohamed Salah. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. And here's Mohamed Salah. Has a hit! Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Well positioned to make that interception. Milner. Jota. Milner. Neither side yet able to find the net. Now it's Mohamed Salah. Milner. Jordan Henderson. And it's Milner. And this is Mohamed Salah. Cleared without complication. Fabinho. And here's Mohamed Salah. Mohamed Salah really got caught in a trap there and he just couldn't get out. Done with a searching ball. Fabinho tries lifting it over. Good clearance and very necessary. And here's Mohamed Salah. That is terrific skill. 
That's a foul, no two ways about it. He knew what was coming, that's a yellow card. May feign to shoot and just play it into the box. And somehow it stayed out. Jota. And here's Origi. Wood. Wood looks to get on the end of this. And that'll be the last act of the first half. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Reflections on the first half? Well, they've never really been threatened in the first half. I think it's been a magnificent team effort. The work rate has been superb. Very, very organised. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil-nil. Well, the action has already resumed. Wood with the foul. Gomez. Robertson. That's not going to make it. Defenders on the back foot. Taylor. There will be a throw in. He's got the ball glued to his feet. And here's Henderson. Jota. Oh, shooting chance! They've scored! And some players are just capable of grabbing a game by the scruff of the neck. And his immense talent may just have done exactly that and injected the belief that they can retain their lead this time round. Oh, it's a keeper's nightmare, Peter. He just couldn't pick up on it until it was way too late, having so many bodies in front of him. Liverpool break the deadlock. Well, whatever the manager said in that dressing room at half-time, it's worked a treat. Alexander-Arnold. Forward it goes. Oh, they can break here. No, no way through there. Van Dijk. Decent looking ball, and the counter is on. He's one on and the shot! Oh, no shortage of confidence there. Jay Rodriguez cannot be a happy chappy, and you can understand why the run was stoic and it should have been heroic. Well played, he saw that coming. Henderson hits one! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Well, he did get himself into a good position, something for him to cling to.
And it's Rodriguez. Out to the left it goes. Well, that's pretty clear, it is a foul. Mohamed Salah is being told in no uncertain terms that this will be his final warning. Yeah, and he's just entered the last chance saloon. One wrong move now, and he's in trouble. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Brady with a definite fell there. <laughs> Off the post! Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Jota gets flagged offside. Keeper's got good distance on that. Done very well to intervene. Jay Rodriguez needed to come up with a better ball. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. And helps available out wide. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Salah, he's had a look, big chance! Flings in across. Oh, that's a fine challenge. Jordan Henderson. Bardsley gets rid without sophistication. Alexander-Arnold plays it in. Liverpool can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. Goes down, but nothing given. That was good pressing, forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. Jota, Milner, goes for goal! Really well taken goal! Two ahead, late in the day, game over, surely. Liverpool are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Burnley are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. Yeah, it's about time I think we saw some activity from the bench, but it's it's debatable as to what level of impact can be made from here. It's it's pretty. So that's it. It is all over. Liverpool always look the more driven side, probably the better side, and nobody is arguing about the results. Well, after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Yeah, and a result that 